Uh, just immensely proud of the boys. You know, we, we owed it to ourselves and to everyone watching here. So we lost these lot a couple of weeks ago. Um, we had a rusty start after a long break from Christmas and beat Cardiff Met this last week. So we really wanted to build this week. And um, we've done exactly that. We put into action the messages we got got from the coaches and we, we just produce them and that's what happens. As we said before, we actually said before the game that we didn't just want to win, we really wanted to make a statement after not doing so well a couple of weeks ago. And we did that, you know, we used, we used the wind in the first half, got a couple of points on the ball, got down there and in the second half, when it opened up a bit, we just trusted ourselves with our ball skills and that's exactly what happened. I'm very, 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 very happy with the second half. I think we, we left a lot out there in the first half and didn't sort of play how we wanted to play. Um, but when we started keeping hold of the ball and just thinking about the game and space and how we move it there and how we win collisions, I thought, you know, hopefully the scoreline in the second half sort of shows that, that you know, when we put our foot down, we, we can really play some good rugby. It, it goes from a lot of sort of things that we've, we've been working on back in pre season, um, you know, a little bit of analysis from Cardiff Uni, um, and, you know, from there we, we can put teams under pressure. Um, but I think a lot of credit needs to go that you know we can't have those opportunities unless we get a real, real good solid defence, set piece in an open play. Um, we need the ball back more certain more times than when we don't have the ball. Uh, once we can't go score and try, so yeah, big credit to the, the, to the defence as well. Uh, so I think that's the, that's the big difference. I think we realise that when we have to apply ourselves, both sides of the ball, um, we know what we can do. But we, it's words are just words, and we can actually do it. But I don't we did that from two weeks ago. It's a long drive up to Northumbria next week. How are you going to prepare for that one? 10 day turnaround, so it's a slightly different. The boys have a bit more recovery time. Um, but basically, we will we'll get an opportunity to ramp up, the fed, uh, ramp up our, uh, our training and make it harder than what a game would be. So, from a collision perspective, from a, from a time and ball in play, anything we can to make that, um, make that much harder. Uh, so, these guys are going to be real well prepared. Well, you know, Northumbria, they play some lovely rugby and some open rugby. Um, but I think for us is we have to just focus on ourselves and focus on the game we want to play and um, not get caught up in the massive open play.